Well, beautiful people, welcome back. I'm so glad you guys are here. Welcome to a day of decorating cookies and some more fun. So uh, let's get started. So first of all, I have so many cool decorations that I actually put in the Santa. So we have our sticks. We're going to recreate this one. This is just a marshmallow. We have our bags. We have our little baking cups. And we're going to try and recreate this. This is um, marshmallows. We have our spoons and we have all kinds of decor for the cookies. And we also going to make some pretzels and uh, some spoons. We're also eating very healthy today. I bought this huge tray of vegetables we're going to snack on. And we're going to use these minis. I bought some gingerbread. And we're going to make these as well. But I bought the candy cane sugar cookie dough. Oh my god, my sister has made a whole plate of cookies, you guys. This thing is huge. And then we have a little bit bigger baking cups. We have this size and we have the smaller size. And we have the jumbo. And then we have these to decorate. These are so cute. We have some Santa. Um, we're gonna make some little snowmen. And we have gingerbread. And these, this is all of the candy coatings that I have. And these, you guys, I'm sure you saw this in another video that I did. $2.99 and these are glass. This I also picked up. This is $3.99. This is glass. Love it. We have some pine trees. We have some snowflakes. Sprinkles. And this, of course, we're using to decorate the cookies. It's going to be a little bit easier. And this, you guys, look at this. Holiday sprinkles. And we have tons of eyes. We have the smaller ones and we have the big ones. And of course, our little treat bags. Such a cute little tree. And where's the hamster? He's he's taking a little nap right now. Oh, so cute. Here's a cute little tree. And it looks like Lucky got into this. <laughs> and here's the gorge tree. Look how cute this is. Oh my gosh, it rattles. And my sister loves the poppets, so we actually got one for Keychain, it's Tweety. And then we got the rain, this LOL poppet kit, it's huge. So look, this is pumpkin Greek yogurt. This is delicious. We're gonna put a little bit of walnuts in here. Delish. So um, I was offered the one without the peanut, without the kiss on it. So let's see how it tastes. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I bought these actually from Home Goods. I'm gonna go ahead and try them. These are pink twisted marshmallows. Mmm, these are really good. Christmas carols. And this is Nestle Toll House chocolate chips. They have edible glitter. They are delicious. We're going to start off by using a little parchment paper. And we are going to begin by baking gingerbread cookies. Now, my sister got this little Woodstock coach wristlet. It is so cute. I think it was like 30 bucks online. So you guys go ahead and check that out. So, so cute. I also have my Cookie Crew baking shirt on. I actually got this from Five and Below. And this is from my Black Friday haul. And I will link that below so you guys can see. My sister has her little nut uh, contraption. <laughs> yeah. So we are going to continue baking the cookies. We're cutting them out. And it actually made a guitar. So we're going to throw them in the oven. These you don't have to put in the freezer. They're pretty sturdy. 
meaning they won't flatten out. My sister bakes these delicious little tea cookies. And yes, she's the real baker. She actually makes her own batter. And see, most of these cookies I will put in the freezer, otherwise they spread. And now we're gonna bake the candy cane cookies. And this is Russian sage from my garden. And we're gonna go ahead and put it on some of these cookies. So I did order edible cookies with edible flowers and they are absolutely delicious. I think it's just, it's just such a cool concept. And then last but not least, we're making the Nestle Toll House chocolate chip cookies. Now we're going to try to replicate what I bought from Target. We're trying to squash these and that's just a little bit too small. It's a lot of work to really squash these marshmallows. It's a lot of work. I mean, yeah, they came out pretty good. My sister gave me a rolling pin. Great, great idea. Great idea. And this is the cookies that she made. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's delicious. So yeah, I don't think it came out pretty good. We needed a longer stick, but no, I mean, not too bad. See what happens when you don't put the cookies in the fridge? They spread. And these are the Russian sage cookies. And they are actually delicious. Now we're going to make some spoons. So what I'm doing is I am putting the melted chocolate in the bottom of each baking cup. And I really love the pan that my sister has. And I am putting the peppermint spoons in. And also in the bottom there is a Rolo. And then we're just going to decorate them and let them sit. I've always wanted to make my own peppermint spoons, but um, I haven't got around to it the past two years. I was my sister beating the eggs. <laughs> I think they came up pretty good. And now we're going to decorate some pretzels. My sister had these pretzels that are Christmas shaped. So cute. Very, very easy to do. And we're gonna put a little bit of decorations on them. We were trying to put eyes on them, but they kept sliding to the side. So uh, maybe next time. Yeah, these are so easy, but I'm telling you to find these pretzels, we had to go to a few different stores. Now we're going to replicate what I bought at Target. It's basically a marshmallow that's dipped in chocolate and then it's decorated. So this has a lot of candy on it, so I didn't put too much candy on them. You guys, these are actually, they came out really good. They are absolutely delicious. I'm going to bring them to work for the girls. And go ahead and put a little bit of sprinkles on there. Yeah, I think they came out really good. And for my birthday... My sister made this for me. It's very colorful. It will go with absolutely everything. You guys, it is so soft. It is so soft. I wish you guys could feel this. So yeah, how pretty is this? So pretty.
And we're going to continue with the pretzels. We're going to make a little bit more. And yeah, they came out so cute. And then my sister makes these really fabulous nuts. And now we're just decorating cookies. You know, I thought that using these pre-made icings were a great idea, but the red and the green one was very runny, and the two white ones was very hard. Um, it was actually too hard to use, and you're supposed to put it in the microwave, and then it got too runny, so next time we're just going to make our own. Actually, my sister did make some. So yeah, it just doesn't want to come out. We had so much fun decorating cookies. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope I inspired you to create your own holiday magic. And if you did like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell because you will be the first to be notified of my future videos. And I will see you guys really soon. XO. What's wrong? What's wrong? What do you want? What's wrong? What's wrong?